Hey guys, so today we have to bring you some bad news. Unfortunately, Leo's battle with cancer is now over. We had to put him down the other day. He let us know it was time, and it's been very difficult for us. Um, it has. It's been a really, really rough week. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, we don't. We don't know van life without Leo. No. And we don't know this whole lifestyle without Leo. Yeah, ever since we got on the road, we've had Leo. Uh, we actually have had a dog together ever since we moved in together. So this is the first time we've been living together without a dog. And it feels very strange. It's really hard not having Leo here, waking up to him in the morning or seeing him when we get back to the van, going for our morning, afternoon, and evening walks. Um, or just having to wake up to let him out. Yeah. Um, the it's very strange not to have him around and we knew it was coming but I don't think we I don't think you can prepare for this no. and it's been really tough but as I as we said you know when we shared that Leo had cancer with everyone we're really trying to focus on all the wonderful memories we had with him and he left he enriched our lives so much and we've experienced and met so many incredible people because of him and Leo has just been I know a bright spot in our lives but also in your lives a lot of you have found us and watched our videos because of Leo mm -hmm. and he's I'll miss his smiling face um, and just his stubbornness, his huskiness. Yeah. Uh, but it's, my heart hurts to not have him around, but I know he's in a better place and he, he can play with Duke, our other dog. They can chase squirrels, whatever it is they're doing. Um, I know he's in a better place. Yeah. It's been a, it's it, been rough for him, this bone cancer. Yeah, but he fought it, and when it was time, he let us know. Um, so, I mean, he, he went peacefully, and it's just, like we said, it's very hard not having him here. And this is now a new chapter in our lives. Like Kate said, we knew it was coming. We had talked about it, but it's not something we could really prepare for. Um, you know, we're looking at this next chapter with... A lot of excitement of different things we can do however we wish that we still had Leo and we're not we weren't there yet yeah I'm I'm it's, not ready no and it's been about a week since he passed and it's only now that we're even able to sit down and talk about it um, it's just been it's been a rough few days even before that when we saw it coming on and you know yeah it was I think it was really difficult for me because your mom came to visit with Charlie uh -huh. and he was great yeah and we were joking about how the vet said he wouldn't make it through the holidays and here he is still you know being Leo and enjoying himself enjoying life and he seemed so happy and then just a few days later it was it was a few days later he woke up that morning, he was doing great. Uh, I gave him some treats, some be like dog jerky and everything. He loved it. <laughs> and just later that afternoon, the spark was gone. It and just you, went out. Yeah. And you could tell. But, you know, he's in a better place now. He is in a better place and we have so many amazing memories. And as my dad said, we've memorialized him in all of our <laughs> videos and He'll always live on. He will live on. We have more videos of him than probably of us. <laughs> yep. Leo has taught us a lot and something Kate put down that I read and it really <clears throat> struck a chord with me was this little saying she put together. Be more like Leo. Live in the moment. Love unconditionally. Don't hold a grudge. Keep your head up. Adapt to changes. Be present, 
don't worry about tomorrow, focus on now. And that really encompasses Leo in a nutshell. Then he was a completely <laughs> stubborn animal, which we absolutely stubborn loved. Husky, but that was him. Yeah. It made Leo Leo. And that was so special. But we wanted to treat everyone to a little tribute video that we put together. Some of the fun moments and things that made us laugh over the years. So enjoy it and we'll see you next week. Sorry to bring you this bad news, but hopefully everyone can share a fun memory you had of Leo in one of the videos that we've shared over the last couple years. So thanks guys. Good morning. Good morning, Leo. Leo, don't look so upset. You just had a delicious lunch. He does look kind of upset. Look, bud. It's a new home.